Hey everybody, I'm Dan from Always on Liberty. We're gonna to talk to you a little bit about Moride and some products that they've got for the Overland Expedition accessory market. Stay tuned and come right back. Channel. Today we're very fortunate to be at the Moride booth with Austin Conrad. Moride has pioneered some of the Outlander expedition industry. They've taken some real world experience and applied it to their product line. So this is not a for show type of product line. This is a for go type of product line. It's tried and proven in the field with seven to eight years of experience and it's going to enhance your overlanding experience for sure. Austin, tell us a little bit about the Jeep we're looking at, about the products that Moride has developed for it. Yeah, absolutely. So, uh, as you mentioned, what we're what we're known for is our metal fabrication capabilities. Um, we partnered with an independent designer that's done a great job of kind of designing and maximizing space on your Jeep or overlanding vehicle. So, a big theme that we try to focus on um, in all of our products is how do we be different? How do we differentiate ourselves from the market? And so one product that I'd like to show you real quick is a no-drill install for a Rotopax mount. So Rotopax are very important while you're on the trail. Rotopax can be bought in several different sizes. The one you see here is a two-gallon Rotopax that can be used either for extra fuel or extra water on the trail. So what you do with the Rotopax, you simply twist it, pull it off, you can twist the cap and then you can empty this either into your uh, vehicle for extra fuel or as I mentioned extra water on the trail as well. So the convenience of a Rotopax is always necessary on an overlanding trip or an off-road adventure um, but as I mentioned what we try to do is try to differentiate ourselves from the rest of the market. And One thing we do is we try to focus on no drilling on all of our products. So we tie into existing factory holes and we try to, um, it's just easy to install. So this product only takes about 10 or 15 minutes. So how great is that? No extra holes in the body of your Jeep, use pre-existing hardware. It doesn't get any better than that. That's extremely innovative. And next over here, we have what we call our heavy duty door hinges. These door hinges are available for two door and four door models on the JKs um, and potentially down the road we'll be coming out with the new JLs or to the new hot Jeep uh, at the SEMA show this year. So what's different about these is that they're made out of a stainless steel material, again direct bolt on installation so you're not worrying about drilling, modifying, welding, anything like that. Another unique feature is you can see that the hinge holes on here that are adaptable for adding extra accessories such as a high lift mount. You can attach other steps. Um, as you'll see in the rear door of the Jeep back here, we actually have a step which is perfect for the overlanding community. The purpose of a step, it's collapsible and unlike other steps on the market, it doesn't interfere with your front door. So you can open up your back door it won't interfere with your front door, which is a common problem in the overlanding industry. So how great is that? A stainless steel product, extremely strong, extremely durable, covered by Moride's quality powder coating system. It doesn't get any better. What a great improvement for your Jeep, your overlanding vehicle. And another great feature about these the steps, the hinges, and what they offer is that it gives you really easy access to your overlanding tent on top of the Jeep, on top of your vehicle. Um, typically, what you have to do with an overlanding rooftop tent, they weigh about anywhere from 50 to 120 pounds. So trying to lift that up there, maneuver it, get it set up is always a pain. So what we've done is with the step, you simply grab your rack, you step on it, and you can start accessing contents on top of your Jeep. So this gives you a really easy access to all the content on top of your Jeep, whether that's extra cargo, sleeping bags, extra storage on the front of the rack, or just the tent itself. As we move towards the back of the Jeep, one of our best products that we've come out with in the last five to 10 years is what is called our heavy duty tailgate hinges. In the overlanding, off-roading, and even the mole crawling industries, um, the heavy duty hinges have done really well. The reason for it is as people increase the spare size, uh, the spare tire size on their Jeep, they aren't reinforcing the components on the trailer or on the uh, Jeep itself. So if you want to swing around here, you'll notice the hinges on this Jeep look quite a bit different than what you see on a stock Jeep. These hinges, just like our door hinges, 
offered access holes to add accessories such as our overland rack, such as the Rotopax mount that you saw on the front of the Jeep. You can also attach a high lift mount, which is a necessity in the overlanding market. And there's uh, also the capability to attach a CB mount, which is very helpful on the trail as well. So the improvement in those hinges allows you to add this extra weight without any excess stress points or anything like that. You're not going to crack your tailgate or, or hurt the body of the Jeep or anything like that. And another added benefit and unique feature about our heavy duty hinges is that they are the only greasable hinge on the market. So for about $150 retail, you can install our heavy duty hinges. It'll reduce the rattle, which is very common in the Jeep market uh, due to the stock hinges being a steel and steel contact. So as you open and close your Jeep over time with the weight of the spare tire on the back end, that hint, uh, the metal hinge on the Jeep, the steel and steel contact, tends to wear out, it rusts, it rattles, and that's a common issue in the field. So what we've done with the greasable hinges, we offer a bronze bushing, greasable zerks on them, and then they're also rebuildable if you happen to smash it on the trail. So uh, the only hinge in the market of its kind, they're definitely unique and it's at a price point that makes sense. Absolutely. So beyond that, what we've done here with the Overland Rack, this is a unique accessory that we came out with um, about a year ago. It's made entirely out of aluminum with the exception of one back support. So the whole rack itself only weighs about 40 pounds and is capable of carrying up to 75 pounds of cargo, which is again, very useful for overlanding trips. And a unique feature about this as well is that you can actually install high lifts either on the side at an angle, you can install a high lift vertically up top, and then it gives you a lot of space up top for extra gear such as ammo cans or canvas bags. You can store rotopax mounts on the side and what we've done on both sides as well is we've attached uh, or included um, molly grids for attaching molly pouches as well. So ease of install is a very, th a very important factor for us. No drilling, no modifying, no welding. So that you'll notice that that's a theme for all of our products. And again, the beautiful powder coat job, amazing engineering by Morite's engineers. The durability is here. The quality is amazing. It's like every product that Morite makes. And you have 78 years worth of real world application to prove that the design and the product do really work. So one thing I want to show you next is um, our trail kitchen. It's a new exciting product for us. We've had it for about a couple years. And as you see here on the inside of the Jeep, I'll demo it for you real quick. This is our trail kitchen that's used for real life application for overlanding trips. So with a couple buttons here, you slide out your refrigerator and freezer combination. It gives you perfect access to all of your groceries that you want to carry on the road that way you don't have to run to Walmart. You can see we're actually using it at the show. It's a real working refrigerator and uh, Dometic is a great refrigerator option as well. We've used this one for the last couple years and it's been a perfect uh, setup for us. So with the trail kitchen you see you get extra countertop space on top, you get extra storage space underneath and you simply slide out a couple brackets here, lift up this panel access here to an extra clip-on table which stows on the side of the Jeep. It gives you extra cooking space, cutting board space, and then after that, flip out your extra countertop. You have your faucet to clip on. And then what we've come out with is a collapsible sink. So this is really cool. It actually collapses into just about a one and a half inch space. <laughs> It has a hose fitting on the bottom for like a water hose that you can pick up anywhere on the road. And that allows you to drain water after cooking and cleaning, and you can drain that off to the side. So what we've done, we use a quick disconnect hose on our uh, faucet system. And so this allows you to quickly disconnect and connect your water fitting on the inside of the Jeep. To go along with that, we've also included the option to attach a rotopax for water and there's the option to use a, uh, a Coleman stove or any one burner stove. The nice part about the extra storage underneath is it gives you space to store such things as your stove, cooking utensils, even your clip-on countertop all can fit underneath into this usable space underneath the kitchen. The 
again, beautifully designed, maximizes the space of the vehicle, stretches the availability of the vehicle, truly amazing product. And one more unique feature that we have on the inside of this Jeep that oftentimes gets missed if you're not looking specifically for it is what's called the drop down molly panel. So as they mentioned, one thing we try to focus on is using dead space or unusable space in the Jeep. So what we've done is we've created a fold down or flip down molly panel with uniquely designed uh, mounting pattern for molly pouches, for quick fist clamps that are commonly used in the Overland market, and there's specific locations all over this grid for both rotopacks and other high lift mounts as well. So what this does, as you can see, you simply just fold down the bar, swing up the, the molly panel, and it holds in place using a couple C-clamps. Very efficient storage above the roll bars. It doesn't obstruct your view outside the back end of the Jeep, and it's just a, a very efficient way to store all your gear for overlanding. <laughs> Last product I want to show you real quick is called a store gate. So this gives you, again, more storage on the back end of the Jeep. As you can see, this is real-world application right here. These are all the things you want on the trail. Cleaning utensils, extra um, wrenches and utensils for the road. And this, with just about six screws, can install in the back of the tailgate of the Jeep. And all of our products you see here are available for Jeep Wranglers, primarily Jeep JKUs, which are the four-door four door 07 to 17. Um, but a lot of our products also work on older Jeeps like TJs and CJs as well. So there you have it. Big thank you to Austin Conrad from Moride. They produce a tremendous product at a very nice price point. Real world application. It really doesn't get any better than that. Austin, thank you so much for your time. And we hope you enjoyed the senior show. We've had a great time with you. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thanks, everybody.